What's up YouTube? It's your girl Tam J and I'm back again today with another new video for y'all. Y'all know I'm always coming through for y'all with the hair reviews and all the hair trends. You know, just trying something out new so that y'all won't have to right away. So today is something that I found on Amazon. Um, as you can see, I've began my lock journey. Um, I think it's been a year now, if not a year, almost coming up on a year. I want to say next month makes a full year. So far, I love it. I feel like this is the best decision I've ever made. Like low maintenance is such a vibe. I get a lot of compliments and yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm really enjoying this whole journey. Yeah, y'all should definitely get into it if y'all, um, you know, if any of y'all have ever been thinking about it, considering um, doing locks or anything, or just joining the whole lock journey, you should definitely, definitely get into it. So today, I got something cute for y'all, for my locked and lovely ladies, or gentlemen. Um, so I was on Amazon, and I don't know what made me think to even search this, but y'all know those flower buns that the girls with locks always wear, and I was like, I wonder if they got hair pieces for that. So I looked it up on Amazon and what do you know, or surprise, surprise, because Amazon literally has everything, but they did have it. So I found this store on Amazon, on Amazon called a belly store. I may be pronouncing it wrong. I don't know if it's Abley or a belly, but y'all know either, either way, I'm going to link it down below in the description for y'all. Must be a very low key store. They don't do any type of particular packaging for the piece or anything. A matter of fact, y'all, this is all it came in was this. Just a regular old bubble envelope and tucked away in this little thing here. So yeah, they didn't they didn't do it like any type of special crazy packaging for it. Um and this is what it looks like um fresh out of the package. So y'all know that hair so I'm talking about the little flower all it just looks like a big flower lock of flowers on top of the head on top of the head and i love it so much it's so pretty this is what it looks like you know that's still with the hair in it on when you take it off so yeah you take it off and once you poof it up it has see all the little loops it looks, looks like a blossom like a bloom of flowers i love it it's so cute and i got this in oh don't make me lie, honey. I want to say I got this in a number four. I think it was a number four. If not, I'm going to double check. And I'll put the details in the um, description, like I said. But, you know, it's drawstring. You know, you just pull open the drawstring. And then you just open it up. You want to just open it up to the size of, you know, that fit over your bun. And on the inside, you know, just like a classic drawstring ponytail hair piece set up. You got your comb on the top and the bottom, you know, the little protective knit and everything. And then sitting, you just pop it on the go. I actually bought two of them because I used to, I, I used to see girls um, with these blooms or flowers or whatever you want to call it but they would have them like in space bun styles and I thought that was so cute. So I just wanted to give it a try. I don't know how that's gonna look because these look like they're pretty big and full so but i'm definitely gonna try it out for y'all in this video but yeah um i want to say that these cost like 12 13 dollars a piece so it's very affordable and y'all know y'all can wear this us oh, listen the, the weather is warming up this would be a good like outside hairstyle so many things so many possibilities so I think I got it opened up far, far enough. So we're just gonna pop this on. And child, listen, my hair, these locks are growing. Like they are already in my back. Um, but you know, by them still being a year old, they're still fairly fresh and new. So like my roots and everything are locked. They're like totally locked, like this type of texture. But my ends are still, I have fine curly hair. So my ends are still um, loose. They're trying to lock, but they're not fully locked yet. So my ends are still soft. So I could never achieve this style with my my natural, my regular locks. So yeah, I think this was a good find. So yeah, we're just gonna pop that on. And 
and pull that over. And we're gonna secure the combs. And I would definitely recommend bobby pins. Hold on one second. <laughs> Okay, so I'm back with two bobby pins. I got the two extra long ones. I love these. So I'm just going to stick one on each, on each side because the combs, um, there's one in the front and then one in the back. And I just feel like I want a little extra security, you know, on both sides of this piece. <laughs> Don't get caught unsecured. That is not cute. So get it on in there all good. I stuck it straight through the net. Nothing major. Make sure you don't hurt yourself. Don't be walking around this summer with a headache because your bobby pins are in wrong. We're going to pull that drawstring like so. And I'm going to just wrap around. Tuck that string in and hide it, child. And y'all see how quick that was? Look at how quick I did this. And look how it's just a look. You know, you can just fluff it out and adjust as needed. And this is the final look. <laughs> I feel like this could be so cute for like a wedding, a shower, just a just a cute, girly, flirty type of day. Just a, this is a, a vibe for the warm weather. I love it. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments. Oh, I can't wait to link this for y'all. I want to see all of y'all who are locked. And like me, like your locks are too soft or they might not be long enough or full enough. That's my that's my case. My locks are too soft and I don't feel like my locks are full enough. So I could never achieve this style with my natural hair. So that's why I love these pieces. I love them so much. So I think I'm going to get ready to, um, I'm, I'm going to redo my natural bun, put in two little side buns and pop this other one on. So hopefully... I think this would be cute. I think these, I think the space bones would be cute. So I don't know what y'all been doing. <laughs> I just got off work. Let me take out the pen. And I'll let y'all see um, how, how I was telling you about my hair. Matter of fact, yes. child, how many scrunches I got on? Whew, okay. So yeah, yeah, this is my natural hair. So you can see like I got a little bit of length, but you know, I could never achieve it with it. Don't judge me because I did only retwist the parameter, perimeter of my head and not the middle. So if you see a little new growth and some need to be retwisted, mind your business. Mind your business. But yeah. So yeah, it's, yeah. You see it's like they're so soft, they're still curly at the ends. So yeah, I couldn't do that style. But you see the roots and everything, are those are fully locked. I'm all good on the roots. But other than that, I, I love it. I love the lock journey. I feel like I should have did this a long time ago. But I love it. And I love the length of my hair is at now too. Cause it's not too much, but it's just enough to like serve a cute look. And I would do like ha have pieces hanging out, but as you can see, I, my ends are covered. So I don't think it'll look right with those pieces. So we can do is just some quick buns. And they're kind of big and full, so I think I should probably space them out a little bit so they won't be bunched all up on top of each other. But at the same time, I don't want them like just sitting on the side of my head looking crazy. So. I don't know y'all. Y'all know y'all know me. I experiment for y'all, so y'all won't have to. So we're gonna do that right now. Don't worry, we're out of the game and tuck that. And if y'all doing this style, please make sure your knots, your little balls are even. Don't have one up further than the other. That is not cute, see. That is not cute. Oh, and they sent these scrunches with them too, so with the hair pieces. So that's that's helpful. So let's just secure all this. Ooh, they stretch it too, y'all. Yeah, but I think that store name is Abelie. Abelie. Y'all will see. 
And y'all will see. Forgive me if I'm mispronouncing it. Oof. These look so crazy. But for the sake of a video, this is where we at. So that's it. I just throw them up into two little space buns. Nothing special. So I'm going to take one and pop it on. I really feel like these are like going to be too big. I feel like it's not going to get a look that I'm thinking it's going to um, give. Well, let's see, hun. <sighs> Trying to work out. Um, I don't... I don't think I need the bobby pins on the side for this one. I mean, you could, but I'm not going to do it. Well, I, I might. Hold on. Hmm. Let's see. And then I think the bobby pins help too because instead of having them, you know, the bobby pin kind of like shapes it a little bit more to your head. You know, you don't want them sitting off of your head, you know. So the bobby pins really help with that. See, here comes the other one. Just don't look in the mirror, y'all. Don't mind me. So cute. So it did kind of like, I think it did give the look that I thought it was going to give. Um, I feel like this part is a little funny. But you know what? That's what the bobby pins for. We're going to make it like how we want to like. Okay. Y'all, this is so cute. This would be so cute for like a 70s party or anything like that. Like, it's so cute. If it looks crazy in the back again, don't judge me. Well, y'all, this is so cute. What is this? Oh, see what I'm saying? Soft hair, fine hair, annoying. But yeah, y'all, this is the look. Isn't this like the cutest thing? Look at the texture. I disregard this. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, this is the texture up close. As you can see, it's like a 4C texture. It's very realistic. Um, I'm pretty sure, though, it's synthetic fibers, of course. But even still, you know, it really mimics the texture of true locked hair. So to find this on Amazon, I end up typing in, I end up searching dreadlock hair piece. And y'all know we don't call them dreads, baby. Ain't nothing dread for over here, honey. So, yeah, but unfortunately, that's the name they um, have it under. I'm pretty sure you can... Find it on another name, but of course, as always, I will link it down below. But y'all, this is just so cute. This will also be cute on like younger girls, like teenagers, or you know, any of those young girls with locks. This is really cute. I think this will be great alternatives for people who are starting off with their locks. You know, if your locks are short, but you know, long enough to go into um, a bun or a ponytail. Honey, you can't go wrong with this, but this is so cute. Tell me what y'all like. Tell me what y'all think. But yeah, again, this is the lock hair piece. That's what we're gonna call it. It's just a lock hair head piece, hair piece uh, from a belly store. Um, again, it will be linked down below. And I really hope y'all enjoyed this quick little video. Y'all know I'm always coming through for y'all. Let me know what you want to see next. And I will do my best to get on top of that for you. So, yeah, thank y'all again for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not, because I have plenty more reviews and everything else coming up. So, yeah, see y'all until the next time.